Pickens and his company Orion, which is now called Dianetics, are the inventors of this motor. And this is a five pound thruster, and so it's, it's a baby one. So you can imagine if you ramp this up, the things are working on future iterations of larger motors. And uh, so, Tim, maybe you'd want to talk to the folks? Uh, sure, I appreciate that. Yeah, you know, this, this guy's a Basically, it's, uh, we designed this motor to run, like you said, on hydrogen and oxygen, and we're running at our very, uh, very uh, basically, we're running a little over two to one hydrogen to, to oxygen, or the oxygen to hydrogen fuel ratio. So, you know, we, we, need, uh, we need all the oxygen for cabin makeup. So, uh, basically, we're burning a lot of hydrogen, and because it's such a low molecular weight, our performance is still really good right around 400 seconds of ISP. So we're, you know, we're real excited. We built this just to uh, do a demo. This is half on. And, uh, but it's a real rocket engine. Other than this not having the fully expanded space model, it's exactly what he got, what they'll be flying on Sundays. Now we understand that what Pat wants to do, she has a bicycle at home, and she wants another version of this strapped onto the rear of a bicycle. seconds to where you get to a, a uh, enough of an ambient temperature to be able to fire it again. So that's that's a matter of pulling down the nozzle so it doesn't uh, it doesn't damage anything internally. And again it takes four or five minutes. 